Like most parents, Shantae Guy and Stephen Manning want to feed their baby the healthiest foods. When they realized the big brand products they'd been buying might not be the best for their son, they took matters into their own hands. If it wasn't for us having a son, none of it would have came about because I wasn't thinking of baby food. I wasn't thinking of uh, making anything for little kids. Not at all. When Steve became old enough to be able to actually eat baby food, it was time to decide what the best one was. And you really want to research what you put in your baby's body. And we were finding that there are things that people wouldn't even expect to be in baby foods. Last week, a congressional investigation found that some of the big name baby food companies knowingly put heavy metals like lead and mercury in their products. According to the report, even low level exposure to these toxic metals can seriously damage a child's brain development. When the pandemic hit last March, Manning lost his job. Determined to find a new source of income, he tried making music and DJing, but he wasn't making ends meet. At that point, Manning and Guy, his fiance, had already been feeding their son homemade smoothies that used organic ingredients like fresh fruits, honey, and chia seeds. When they gave the smoothies to friends to feed their kids, the babies and the parents wanted more. That's what sparked me to say, okay, right now I have $3,000 saved in unemployment. I'm gonna just buy three um, blenders and a bunch of um, pouches. I started with smoothie pouches. And it went from smoothies to smoothie bites. I think it's easier for children to hold them and it's easier for them to be mess free and they're easier to travel with. Right now, they're running their business, Koala's Pantry, from their kitchen. But Guy and Manning hope to eventually have Koala's Pantry products on shelves across Michigan. The parents recently struck a deal with the grocery chain Meyer and will have their organic baby foods featured at Capital City Market in downtown Lansing later this year. There is nothing bigger or greater in our lives than our children. There are six of them all together and the only way to keep them happy is to keep them healthy and keep them safe. And the only way I can make sure that my children are healthy is to make sure that I'm feeding them the right things. Reporting in Lansing, Keisha Young, Fox 47.